Hey everyone, welcome back to Anxiety Art Adventures. Hope everyone is doing well and having a fabulous week. Uh, I am having a great week and things are going just lovely. Okay, so today I'm going to be doing a post review of um, Underwater Rainbow by Sparkle Queen Creations. And this canvas I finished for No Start November. I had started this uh, earlier in the year and I had put it to the side. I got a little frustrated with it and I'll, I'll get into that um, later. Um, but I wanted to go ahead and finish a whip for No Start November, so I did. Okay, so this is a 50 by 30 centimeter round drill cut. Uh, this canvas is double-sided adhesive. Now, I'm not usually a fan of double-sided adhesive only because you can't really move your drills around once you put them down. They're, it's very, very sticky and you have to be really careful when you move the drills around that you don't damage the adhesive on the canvas. So you really got to be sure with your placement when um, working on a double-sided adhesive canvas. But I love the artwork. This is artwork actually from Mitzi, the owner of Sparkle Queen Creation. She did this artwork herself. It's beautiful. I love it. It's very, you know, pop art, very watercolorish. It's just, I love it. Absolutely love it. So Mitzi did a fabulous job on the artwork. Absolutely just adore it. So, um, yeah. So like I said, the canvas was very sticky. Most of the drills were good. And this is what I had for trash drills using my little, my 3d, um, container here. So not a whole lot of trash drills and really the trash was, hopefully you guys can see that. Um, most of the trash was where the drills were just either not, you know, not the same size. There were a lot that were smaller, just had a little, little bits of, you know, trash in there. No big deal. But I mean, that's not a whole lot of trash. I mean, any, and I say this all the time, any canvas you work on, you're going to have some, some drills, you know, that are trash and that's just, that's normal, you know, completely normal. So very minimal trash. So that was good, good, good. And I did get another canvas from Sparkle Queen Creations. It's a Howie Green canvas. It's pop art red. I think it's Pop Art Red Bubble Fish is what it's called. Um, I'll put a link up in the eye so you can see that one. I haven't started that one yet. Hopefully I'll get to that next year. Um, yes. So um, the positives, everything was great. You do have a key code over here on the right. I do wish there was a key code on the left, but for a canvas of this size, it's okay to only have one on the right side because you're, you're working on the whole canvas just like this. You don't have to turn it or anything like that. Um, on larger canvases, I do appreciate having the key code on both sides. Okay, now this is your inventory sheet that you get um, with the kit. It is a colored inventory sheet, so I appreciate that. And it lists, of course, all of your symbols. I don't know if you guys can see that. All of your symbols uh, with your uh, color, your DMC color, and then how many bags of each one you should have. Now, the bags came in... Um, they weren't pre-bagged. I had to actually kit up, which is fun. And then it also gives you your quantity of how many drills you should have. Um, not that I'm going to sit there and count. I don't think any of us are going to sit there and count. So, um, yes. So the only problem uh, drill I had was 3750, which is 33. And it's that dark symbol right there with the round in it. It was hard for me to see that symbol. It was blurry. Um, it was just, it wasn't very clear. But all of the other symbols were fine. Um, so maybe just, you know, having having that symbol made a little bit more clear would have been, would have been nice. But overall, you know, like I said, oh, and the other thing is I noticed, I don't know if you can see this, but the sides are fraying a little bit. So my suggestion would be just to do, um, maybe do like a scalloped edge, 
because yeah you can see where it's spraying right there maybe do a scalloped edge to prevent the sides from fraying um, yeah but I had fun working on this and I feel accomplished that I was able to finish it let me hold it up close to you so you can see all the drills very sparkly all the drills were very sparkly uh, there were no ABs in this one, which is okay. Um, I could have, you know, replaced some if I wanted to, but there were so many different areas of color, a lot of confetti in this canvas. Um, I just wasn't comfortable with trying to figure out where to place, um, you know, the if I wanted to put sparklers in. So I just wanted to leave it the original, the original colors. So yes. Uh, let me know in the comments below if anyone else uh, purchased this kit and worked on it and finished it and what were your thoughts. Um, I thoroughly, you know, enjoyed working on it and um, I'm looking forward to working on the other one that I got from Sparkle Queen Creations. But yeah, it was just those suggestions. Maybe make the, the darker symbols a little bit clearer. Um, have the sides be scalloped so that there's no fraying. Um, yeah, and then maybe, you know, hopefully down the road, because I know Missy is basically, you know, a one-person show and is doing all of this on her own, and I'm I'm just thrilled that she started this diamond painting company, and I know it's a lot of hard work. Uh, maybe down the road, um, she can offer a poured glue canvas option, um, as well as the double-sided adhesive. I know the poured glue is more expensive, um, and for just starting out, you know, I totally understand doing the double-sided adhesive. So, um, yeah, so definitely check out Sparkle Queen Creations. I will have the link down below so you can uh, look at all of the really awesome uh, kits that Mitzi has available. She also has a lot of cool cover binders and accessories on her site. So I will definitely have that down below. So please go check her out. Okay, so yeah, and I had plenty like plenty of drills left over. These are all my drills I had left over. I mean, I did not run out of any drills. Look at those oranges, they're so pretty. Um, and I went ahead and, and bagged these, you know, myself. Um, but, oh, the colors in this are just gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So, had plenty of drills left over, no problem there. So yes, absolutely. This is Underwater Rainbow by Sparkle Queen Creations. All right, do me a favor in the comments, leave me a rainbow emoji. Yes, for the beautiful underwater rainbow. Yes, okay, I hope everybody has a fabulous, fabulous day and rest of your week, and I will see you again very soon. Bye guys.